Professor Soborno Isaac Bari's plane just arrived in Johannesburg, South Africa. Professor Dr. H. P. Klopper came to the Johannesburg Airport on behalf of the Da Vinci Institute to welcome Professor Soborno Isaac to South Africa. Many Bangladeshis and Indians came to the Johannesburg Airport to greet with the professor. <laughs> Academics, businessmen, mathematicians, psychologists, educators and scientists of South Africa sit in a circle to interview Professor Soborno Isaac Bari, who is known as the god of mathematics. The interview is hosted by Professor Dr. Ben Anderson, the executive chair of the Da Vinci Institute. Any questions to Prof. Bari? No question yet. Okay. So, if you had to think outside of the box for that matter and tell a youngster in either developed or the developing world what what would be the things that you wish they could consider to get to this state that you're talking and i talking about where there should be a more awareness the consciousness is a very powerful yet neglected construct but what would be some ideas that you may have but you could also decide to be more private on that and at least say what could people consider to become more aware of this dance between algorithms and algorithms in the serving of society. I feel like the more important thing is consciousness is really an out or will be an our outgrowth it will be like I think a breakaway of main uh, mainly technological development I think that consciousness will be the product of technological development so I think that we need to make people more aware that technological development in general isn't going to kill us or uh, we shouldn't stigmatize that kind of thing or make it seem like technological advancement is bad and we also have our students nowadays in schools really disencouraged from science we uh, I feel like in schools we discriminate science we teach all other subjects perfectly but math and science we just don't teach it well because we just throw equations at people's face without uh, uh, telling them what they mean or giving them a demonstration and that's um, uh, mostly either because the school doesn't have enough funding which the, the US is it hasn't been working on definitely hasn't been working on or the thing is they just won't give our students an understanding of technology they're not willing to and that's what uh, that that i feel what's keeping us back from moving forward with this kind of technology i feel like we have to encourage our students that math and science is to, um, not boring but another kind of art Math and science is the thing that will help us advance, not the thing that you need to memorize for your test to, so you can get a 105 and not cry to your mom when you get home. <laughs> Congratulations on winning the Da Vinci Laureate Award. Thank you, Sir Isaac Newton. A big fan. Congratulations, Da Vinci Laureate Suborno Isaac Berry. Thank you, Albert Einstein. A big fan. To Bari Science Lab to fall in love with math and science, especially programming.